Handheld distress flares are a visual way of raising the alarm and pinpointing your position to rescuers when they're within sight of the signal being used. All Australian states require recreational power boats and yachts with motors to carry two handheld red flares and two orange smoke flares. Which flare do you use when? Orange flares are for daytime use only. This one emits a cloud of vivid expanding smoke which is visible for up to 60 seconds at more than 4 kilometres at sea level and further from aircraft. Red hand flares pinpoint your position to rescuers at night. This red flare emits a brilliant light for 60 seconds that can be seen up to 10 kilometres at sea level and can be used in daylight as well with reduced effect. Parachute red rockets are for longer range signalling at night. This parachute flare lifts its payload to 300 metres where it deploys a red star flare which burns for 40 seconds and can be seen up to 40 kilometres away at night and 15 kilometres in daylight. How to ignite handheld flares? Flares are dangerous and burn at up to 2000 degrees Celsius. It is important that you follow the manufacturer's instructions. Check that the correct flare has been selected. Before firing a handheld flare, check that rescuers are in your line of sight. This orange flare has a raised O on the cap, so you can identify it in the dark. This red flare has a raised plus on the top, for the same reason. To light this flare, you hold it safely at the base, twist off the top cap, hold the handle with the signal pointing up and away from you, firmly pull out the yellow igniter knob on top of the flare, up and out of it in a smooth steady motion. Hold the lighted signal up high outboard on the leeward side of your boat. Dispose of the used signal which will be very hot by putting it in water. Other models may be lit by a striker cap. Know what type of flares you have and read the instructions periodically so that you are prepared for emergencies. Regulations demand that your distress flares are in good order and up to date. Always stow them in a waterproof container which is readily accessible in an emergency. Pyrotechnic flares expire after three years, so it is important to check your expiry date every year.